Welcome back everybody, Red Thorn here, bringing you Fortress Siege number 65 here in Lineage 2 Revolution. Let's go! Here are the results of the poll that I took and check it out. The pattern has been broken for the second week in a row. We've had four or more fights, real fights. This week we have six and the winner Fira versus Oblivion. Oblivion here at number 7 at 428.6 million combat power in totality for their clan. Fira at number 12, 367.2 million combat power in totality for their clan. Here is the CP difference between the two. This is for an A grade Fortress Oblivion, 88 million. 888,888 888 Adena for the right to challenge Fira. Somebody thought they were being cute. Let's look at their leaders. Fira's leader, Hooter. Hooter is 10.2 million. Wow, that's but not a tank though. But I guess it doesn't matter when you're 10.2. Let's check out Oblivion. Curious, 9.9 .9 million. Let's head into the battlefield. Fira! In the blue, on the top, the defenders, Oblivion. In the red, on the bottom, the attackers. We've got 1 minute and 43 seconds for the beginning of this battle. And by the way, I can't seem to get any sound. I, I, I mean, I have sound effects, but I don't have any music. And I have it turned up to like 25, but there's nothing. So for this particular video, I guess there's just simply... No battle music to be had. I don't know what's going on here. I it's I don't I don't know. There was music last week, I think, so something happened yeah, during that time. But I'll see you at the 10 second countdown. 10 seconds before we begin. Five seconds before we begin. This is super annoying with no music. And here we go. Fortress Seeds number 65. Fira. Defending against Oblivion. And it looks like they haven't given us the ability to see the altar imprints yet. But we can still see Holy Artifact imprint time. This right tower is almost gone. It is gone. Neither team able to get a buff going on. So we're just going to roam around. Wow, where is the music? That is this is super annoying. I I can't I can't lie to you. I am so used to having some type of in the background type of battle music going on and it's just not happening right now. More bugs for Netmarble to fix. There goes the non-spawn gate of Fira. They're fiddle sticking up there. Oh, looks like uh, Fira got a 10% buff. I missed that on the screen. So here's the big battle right here.
Interesting thing to note, Fira has a 13 million combat power player on their side. Probably incredibly difficult to kill. Oblivion, unable to get any kind of buff going on right now. See how their towers are taking a little bit of a beating. That left tower is, at least. Jace Rain, trying to get the 10%. Or potentially 30 and he got at least 10% for Oblivion for the next three minutes. I don't know who got this one. I didn't see it. I didn't hear anything. I just saw Curious try to get some time there. I'm just not hearing, I mean, I'm not hearing the voice. I'm just hearing sound effects, and I have all the stuff turned on, which is... Unless I miss something. I'm gonna ask on Discord. We'll try to do this at the same time. Probably hear me typing. Live in. With 0.2 seconds of imprint time over Vera right now. <laughs> uh. True. Trying to... Oh! They must have been close. Trying again, though. Interrupted. How's this one doing? Obviously, it's doing fine. <laughs> oh, that kind of sucks when you can't see it. Alright, well, there's a 30% buff for about three minutes. Well, a little under three minutes. Look at that. Oblivion got them both. At almost the same time. Decided to go after the spawn gate defense towers. 
with this 30% buff. Who was that? A red name just ran in here, ran around, ran out. <laughs> oh, look at this. Just a few people over here has got the vast majority of Fira on this side while Oblivion, the rest of Oblivion is trying to take down, is taking down these two defense towers. Good strategy. Thirty five consecutive kills in a fortress siege. That is outstanding. There goes one of the defensive towers for the spawn gate of Fira. Curious is trying to he got two point six seconds that time. Forty consecutive kills by Gomenesai. Wow. Must be an archer or something, just staying away from everybody and picking them off. That's the way you do it though. How are these towers doing? Oh, you got some more time. 1.1 seconds there. Ten percent buff for Oblivion for the next three minutes. And it looks like uh, Pub's trying to get them the 30% for about two and a half minutes, maybe. And they have done so. Another 30% buff for Oblivion. We can hear me running through, which I've never been able to hear before as a spectator. We've always been like shadows. We're there, but that's about it. But now I can hear myself. We are over one third of the way through this battle. And there goes the spawn gate of Fira. Allowing Oblivion to attempt to play a little open siege here. Or not. Doesn't look like they were able to do much. And there goes that holy artifact defense tower. I don't even think Fira has Fira hasn't even taken down a defensive tower for one of the gates yet. Oh, Curious wanted me to get his good side, so there you go. He's got 10 seconds remaining before he, he wins this battle. 8 seconds. 6. 4. 3. 2. 
won a congratulations to Oblivion for successfully taking the A-grade forces away from Fira. And oh, look! You heard that music. Here are your stats. Congratulations to Dr. Kuo for taking number one overall. It looks like maybe they're on top. Wow, they still haven't. They need to fix that. Bunch of dashes on both sides. Yep, still needs to have some things fixed after that update. I mean, Gomenesai, 54 kills and 3 deaths. They're probably number one. I'm willing to bet. But there's 54 and 10 with one defense tower destroyed, so Quinn might be number one. I don't know. We don't know. There are your stats. Let's see how everyone else did. Aeon versus Down and Under. Aeon won that one. Unruly versus Mythic. Unruly won that one. That was not a real fight. That These are for Bs. Here in the A's, Ataraxi won against Sincerity. Oblivion won against Fira. Empire won against Omega Squad. That one was the closest one, but that one's apparently already done. And that is the end of that. Oh, there was FSK versus Yorha. And FSK won that. Congratulations to all the winners. Don't forget to like, subscribe, share this video. And hit me up on Discord or Twitter. Thanks so much for watching, and I will see you again.